In this video, I'm going to show you how you can use Linktree, which is a free link in bio tool. Now I'm going to explain everything that you need to know as a beginner, so you can create the best landing page to put in your bio of your social media profiles. So first we need to go to the Linktree landing page and we can create our account. To do that, what I recommend you do is go to Google, just search for Linktree and it will be the first one. So once you're here, you can go ahead and sign up for free in the top right hand corner. So go ahead and do that. Once you've done that, you'll be redirected to this window where you can then create your account. So you need to enter in an email and a username. Now the username is important because this username is gonna show at the end of your Linktree link. So your link is going to be Linktree forward slash then your username. So try and make your username as clean and as brandable as possible. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab an email address here and I'll just paste that into Linktree here. Now it's gonna give you a username that it suggests. I recommend removing this and typing out a username which fits your brand. I'm just gonna try and register one closest to my real name, which is Bradley Harrison. And it looks like in this case that this username is available, which is actually quite lucky. So now I'm gonna go ahead and create an account. Now we need to enter in a strong password, so go ahead and do that. And now we've done that, we can now tell Linktree our name and then continue. And you wanna select the category that best describes your link tree. So in my case, it's education. And yeah, we'll leave it on that. And then we can scroll down and I'm gonna put e-learning here as well and then click continue. Okay, so now it's going to try and upsell you to a seven day, seven day free trial to Linktree Pro. What I would do is scroll down, click maybe later. So you can just use the free version of Linktree. And now you need to go ahead and verify your account. Okay, so I've just gone ahead and verified my Linktree profile. And now we're in the dashboard and we can start to build out our landing page. So you can see you've got your landing page here on the right and any changes that you make, they're gonna show here on the, on the landing page in real time. Now, if you wanted to share your landing page at any point, go to share in the top right hand corner and click copy. And here you can grab a copy, copy of your link to the landing page. So if I open up a new tab and I just simply paste in this link, we'll be able to check out our landing page. And this is what it looks like right now on the computer. And this is gonna update in real time as well. So going back to Linktree, we can now go ahead and add links. So first we're gonna go ahead and click on add link and we need to now enter in a URL. So let's say for the video that I want to add the URL of my YouTube channel. So let's go to my channel. I can then copy my channel URL. I can then go back to Linktree and I can then paste in a URL here and then click add. That's then gonna add that link to my landing page. And then what I can do is I can go ahead to the edit tool and customize the title. So I'll just call this YouTube. Okay, so now we've got this button updated and it's now called YouTube. Now what you can also do, um, you can go ahead and go to thumbnail. You can add a thumbnail or an icon. Now you can upload your own thumbnail or you can choose from Linktree's thumbnails. So if I search for YouTube, you can see we have a YouTube icon. So if we click on that, there you go, Linktree adds the YouTube icon for us. You can also add emojis into this title. So if you're doing this on phone, you can add emojis. You can also add emojis on computer. And the quickest way that I like to do that is just open up a new tab and type in emoji. And then you can go to getemoji.com and then you can just search for an emoji here. So I'll just search for video. And then let's say we want this video camera. We can click on it, we can click copy. Then if you go ahead and go back to Linktree, you can paste in that emoji. And there you go, now you've got your emoji. So maybe you don't want the thumbnail, you just want the emoji here. You also have the option to prioritize a link and then you have some scheduling tools which I'm not gonna go into. If you click on prioritize, it's gonna prioritize that link and like flash it to people if that's the one you draw, wanna draw people's attention to. And you can add as many links as you want here. So let me just add another link. I'll just link to Google, just to, as an example here. So now we've added another link and you can see that link appears at the top of our YouTube link. Now, if we wanted to move these around, we can go ahead and go to the left-hand corner of the card and then you can drag them up and down and you can, you can move them wherever you want. Also, if you wanted to delete a link, the delete button is here. Now let's move into the appearance. So if you go to the appearance section, it will then take you to your profile. Here you can go ahead and upload an image. You can 
add a title and you can write a bio. So write in a bio here. You can also add your social icons here too. So if you click add social icons, what you can do is you can click add icons and you can add any of your social media platforms here. You just have to connect them. Connecting them is easy though. You just click on the social media you want to add. Then you enter in your username and it's going to ask you then to connect it. So you just need to log in to verify that it's you. But anyway, going back to appearance, you can also customize your landing pages theme. So if you scroll down even more, there are some themes that you can use for free. I like to change to either Lake White here, which is okay. And you can also customize them yourself. If you want to scroll down here, you can choose some of these. Here on custom appearance, you can actually change the background and choose your own color. If you have a color for your brand, like a specific color, you can also choose the button layout. You can also edit the fonts. And all of this can be done in the appearance section. And then again, once you're happy with your Linktree profile, go to your landing page, refresh it, and it should then be updated. Now you are gonna have this Linktree button here if you're on the free plan. That is the only drawback about Linktree. But if you wanna go ahead and upgrade in the future, you can do that and get rid of this button here. So that's been Linktree, that's how you can use it. I hope that was a brief overview and it did help you out. If it did, make sure you leave a like and comment down below.